Fitness is sponsored by Intermountain Healthcare. All right, we have Jeffrey Beck here, exercise specialist with Intermountain Heart Institute. Thanks so much for coming in. And pregnancy exercises, a lot of people worry about exercising while they're pregnant. Yes, well, they don't understand that uh, it's, it's very important to exercise while you're pregnant. It helps to stave off gestational diabetes mm -hmm. and improves your stamina and strength for the labor and delivery process. And recovery. Absolutely, okay, yes. All of that. So, uh, well, let's let's, yeah, let's get, get started. started. Yes, we're going to yeah. start by doing some squats okay. with a postural movement. So let's put our feet wider than shoulder width okay, apart or hip width. All right. And we're going to place the dumbbells up with our palms facing us. So we're going to mm -hmm. squat down now, and then when we come up, we're going to I'll rotate the that. weights okay. out. So, yeah, you don't have to, you can just stand there and look pretty, Mary, if you'd you like. Do the wardrobe malfunction here. <laughs> yeah. uh, now, you also should check with your doctor before you do exercises when yes, you're Yes, you should. Right? Yeah, make sure everything you're doing is safe and you don't have any underlying conditions. But, uh, yeah, this is great for improving leg strength and your posture. With right. That extra movement there. Okay, and the next one is posture based too. That's right, yes. It prevents slouching, which comes on when you're uh, pregnant, which pushes your... Uh, well, and as the weight grows, you might tend to use a yes, different posture. Precisely. Okay. So this is just a simple bent over dumbbell row, yeah. just like so. You're going to hinge forward at your hips until your upper body is about parallel to the floor. You want to keep your back straight, right? Correct. Okay. Pinch the shoulder blades together at the top. Just like this, about three sets of 12 repetitions. See, now that's one also that you can, when you're not pregnant, for to prevent dowager's, dowager's hump. Yes. Right? Yeah, Keeping that's right. Keeping those muscles strong. Yes, okay. very good, Mary. <laughs> Using We've words I've before. never heard before. <laughs> <laughs> Next, we're going to do uh, some core work from a standing position. Elbow to knee. So you're going to come down like this. Pretty simple. Okay. Just out to the side, three sets of 12 reps per side. Boom, like this. You don't want to have a weight on this one, right? Nope, just okay. body weight. More stretching and core. That's right. Okay. And finally, one of my favorite things, belly dancing. Belly you can learn what? how to belly dance, yes. Okay. It's a low well, impact. And some women like a class. Yeah, fitness classes. If you setting. enjoy fitness class settings, mm -hmm. this is great for that. So you're just going to bend your knees here. This is the basic hip lift and hmm. shimmy. I think you should teach Ron this one. Yes. Neat bent knees and just shimmy. Yeah, just like okay. this. Wow. And then, of course, the <laughs> upper body. The upper shimmy. That helps. Okay, and uh, Debbie wanted to know how far along you are. Oh, do I really look that fat on TV? <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> Not at all. I honestly expected you to wear one of those, the fake bellies, and oh. try to do the exercises. That's your next challenge. Well, this okay. is actually part one and part two okay. of the series. We'll next week. More what to do after the baby's okay, arrived. Great. So the answer Good may deal. shock you. All right, back into you guys. <laughs> we love to be shocked. 